Are you all okay? Yeah, we did pretty well there. It looks like the flow <clears throat> of malevolence has stopped, although its operations have yet to be ceased. Here, take these glasses as my thanks. The thanks? Huh. I can still see Miklio. Oh, I can see them now. It's a miracle made by Sophie's pure heart. Mm. I bet. <laughs> you mean these glasses? Yes, they're just normal glasses. What the? At last. We can go back to Asbel and the others. I'm happy. I don't for know you guys. who an Asbel is, but Thank you. good for you. <laughs> now I can keep my promise, thanks to you all. And then she'll tell everybody about Uncle Jade. Experience, though I don't think I'd care to relive it. Thanks. <laughs> but nonetheless, I must thank you. You really helped us. <laughs> now I and my Waka belt must Farewell. go. Farewell. A different world, huh? It's like something from a dream. It's no dream. Yeah, Edna will get to do that someday. You're right. Yeah. And you still have the glasses, right? Oh, wait, did we get an item? Oh. What's wrong, Edna? The Earth Pulse is activating. Huh? What do you mean? The Earth is increasing its power, which means that Maltellus is getting stronger, too. And so is held off, huh? But why so suddenly? <clears throat> or maybe it's not activating, but returning to normal. The malevolence we saw on Hexen Isle was enough to distort time and space. I see. So it was restricting Maltellus' power this whole time. the flow of the Earth Pulse? Then we're the cause for stopping it. I'm so sorry. I should have noticed earlier. Saray and Rose would have done it anyways. That's how they are. So you say. It means they've grown stronger. As have I. It's the decision they made. No sense in regretting it. You're right. I want to grow stronger too. And we got a mini Lloyd. Some old colors and more AP. Yay! And now everything's all bright and sunny. And now we're done with Hex and Isle. So what was the ruin's purpose anyway? Most likely, your hypothesis of a dragon farm is correct. There was a Seraph civilization which utilized dragons in the past. <clears throat> what were they after? And what was their relationship with humans like? I'm afraid their relationship wasn't an amicable one. <clears throat> also, there were no signs of anyone having lived here. Even if they had the power to catch dragons, it must have been hard. <sighs> the era shapes the people, I suppose. <laughs> So Mr. Shepard and Mick Boy have learned about humans and Seraphim through the ruins. That's how they've always been. Are you seriously just now realizing that? Well, excuse me! No. I haven't understood the true meaning of it until now. I realized after embarking on this journey and visiting many I other like ruins, that Zavid just doesn't want to correct his misconceptions the either. Of the collective <laughs> efforts of mankind. I feel the same way too. Then this journey wasn't a waste after all. Isn't it too early to say that? Yeah, we haven't found what we're looking for yet. A ruin that leads to our dreams. We'll find it someday, for sure. Well, ain't that nice. We do that. Huh, <sighs> so ladylike, huh? Ladylike. All right, I think that's the last side quest? Seems like it. Yeah. <laughs> well, <sighs> that's par for the course. Okay, cool. You made it to Lady Lake. Yeah. It only okay. took two more <laughs> tries. <laughs> All right. Uh, what? Mabo curry, fish and chips, something? Uh, one KO'd. Sure. Just in case something goes south. Hmm? Huh. Lila? What's wrong? Oh, sorry. Didn't mean to wake you up. And? It looks like Lila's not here. I wonder if something happened. Hmm. She's probably okay. But... Even Lila probably has sides she'd rather not show to the rest of us. Hmm. Has she always gone off by herself when we've had rough times? I don't know. Probably. I didn't know. I don't think she wanted anyone to know. Just let her be. Oh my. Are you two up already? Lila, are you okay? Huh? 
You were gone, and Saray was having a right old freak out. Oh, I was just taking a walk outside. Sorry for making you worry. You don't have to apologize. Holy mother of capitalism, I can barely watch this. You two are both so awkward. Huh? Saray, Lila isn't a little kid. And Lila, what exactly do friends mean to you? Huh? Why don't we revisit the fundamentals? It all started in this very city, right? Mm -hmm. Go back to that place where your memories are strongest. Uh. Hmm. <laughs> well, this is a pain. So, go back to the shrine. I think I remember this now. Eight Mabo Curry. Dragons? <laughs> yeah, right. Excuse me, pardon me, Shepard coming through. Ooh, herb. There it is. Woo, all to ourselves. <clears throat> Except for the priest over there. Hey, Rose. Yeah. Give him some alone time. Oh. What? What's going on? Mikleo's suggesting we leave you two alone to give you time to soak in your memories. Subtle, Rose. Uh, I truly appreciate your kindness. Both of you. But... Please stay here. I should have told you all. Saray, do you remember what I told you here? Yeah. Uh, Fast Miss do. Mioma? Vividly. <laughs> you made sure I knew exactly what sort of fate would await me as a new shepherd. And now we can tell for sure, in hindsight. You were guiding us so that the fate of the shepherd wouldn't crush us under its weight. Yeah. This journey <coughs> as a shepherd has taught me so much about people, the world, everything. It's a bit embarrassing to say this over and over again, but thanks, Lila. Yeah, thank you. Oh, goodness, no. I should be the one thanking you. And yet... There are things I haven't been able to tell you all. Lila, you don't have to tell us everything. Saray, I have a regret. One that has eaten at me for years. Uh-huh. <sighs> I assume it's about leaving the last shepherd to his fate. Maybe I should have stayed with him. Maybe I should have supported the answer he arrived at and been with him until the very end. And if you had, maybe the end result would have been different. I get it. Pretty much the archetype of a regret. Yes, I suppose it is, isn't it? But I do understand why it is you feel that way. We watched the whole thing unfold, and we felt the same frustration and powerlessness. It must have been even worse for you as his friend. Right. The last shepherd seemed like a solid guy. Yeah. He, at first, he cast a curse on a man using his own nephew duty. as a catalyst. At all times. Also, he, he snuck Motelis out of the shrine that church. Right also, that without telling anyone. No matter what he felt deep it's down. Definitely a suspicious dude. Like Michael stabbed a baby so, to death to cast a curse on a man. He could no mm. longer contain all his anger, grief, and despair. Yeah. The malevolence That's erupted a heck and of then a swallowed point. him up entirely. Is that what you think, Lila? <laughs> and that leads us to her other big regret, huh? That she made the last shepherd too conscious of his duty. That's why she's trying to avoid the same mistake with Saray. Are we getting warmer? Lila. Saray, I've simply been using you. As a way to deny my regrets and keep them bottled up inside. Huh. And so you're apologizing to Saray? Are you serious? Idiot. <laughs> Saray, say it. Huh? 
Mebo, you too. What? But... Idiot. Idiot. <laughs> okay, that's too much. <laughs> Lila, you see what we're getting at? Yes. Friends are here to support you. Right? Yep. I thought I understood that. But worrying too much about your friends can suggest a lack of trust. So don't be afraid to trust them and lean on them. Exploit them. Abuse them. Let them do the hard stuff while you take it easy. Um, too much. Not quite, but good try. <laughs> That's an Edna way Thank to look you. at things, though. Oh, oh, my powers. I really am an idiot after all. To not notice how my own feelings were inhibiting the release of my inner powers. Thank you so much for listening to me, everyone. I feel better. Like the knot in my stomach is gone now. Yeah, I feel exactly the same way somehow. Thank you, Rose. You helped me as well. Thanks. Cool. Hmm. But not us, right? Us real men are too stubborn. I didn't mean that. Wow. Real men sure sound like a pain in the butt. They're just idiots. Damn right we are. Whatever. Idiot, stubborn, I can take it. Let's go. Yes. Right. I am truly grateful I was able to meet you all. And I believe that got us a mystic art. It should have. Yeah, that would have been Lila's second one. Yeah. All right. Well, so, uh, we're out of stuff to do. Kind of. I mean, you know, except for the last thing. Yeah. Well. All right. Ah, yes, shortcut. Or, no, wait, that's the Hexen Isle. There goes the Hexen Isle. We don't want to go there. Okay. Not the shortcut we're looking for. Okay. 